figure we'll take a break from the um, ever brutal, the ever brutal Dark Souls for some relaxing Ratchet and Clank. Enjoy. Man, I don't know. Should I do a new game? I think that's my only choice. Guess I'm doing a new game. Ooh, let's see. <laughs> let's see. An adventure for experienced players whose middle name may or may not be Danger. <laughs> Hard mode it is. new fish i'm captain quark i i don't believe it you're here i used to dream of being arrested by you now get out of here i was talking to you zed yes captain <laughs> so new fish i take it you followed my many many adventures of course, of course i have you're the most famous superhero in the galaxy he ain't famous anymore <laughs> words hurt solitary bill I'm a huge fan. I even pre-ordered the new Ratchet and Clank Hollow game. <laughs> the what? You know, the game based on that incident with you and that Lombax. Oh, you must mean the Hollow film. Yeah, it's pretty good. If you like all CG. No, I mean the game. It's based on the Hollow film. Look, here's my confirmation email. I'm having a wow, match okay. in prison. <laughs> They're making a game based on the Hollow film based on my life? But they haven't even consulted me. Oh, this is my fault. I've been away from my adoring public in this forsaken place too long. And now, no one will ever hear my side. I'd like to hear your side, Captain. You would? Well, then sit down, wary criminal, and I'll tell you a story. It all started with a hapless Lombax named Ratchet. This is gonna be good. Think you're gone. Hey, Grim, you're here. I I thought you'd be down at the bazaar shopping for gravity coils. Uh huh. Well, I'm here. I'm always here. <laughs> I don't suppose you sneaking out would have anything to do with those Galactic Ranger tryouts? I just need one hour. Come on, Grim. These are the Galactic Rangers we're talking about. Captain Quark will be there. No leaving the garage until you help fix Mr. Micron's ship. Now get on that bolt crank. Oh yeah, fourth wall breaking the best. Does that ship look mag lifted to you? Get on. Come on, give it a spin. Game looks real good. Okay, let's see if these new Versa bulbs work. Look up. Do you see something flashing? Oh, I gotta pop my controls around. Yep, left side looks good. It's a miracle. Onto the afterburner lights. Look down. Lower left afterburner light checks out. This thing might just be space worthy after all. One more to the right. Oh. Lower right afterburner works. So, are we good? 
Yep, we're good. The news says the tryouts are being held at the fairgrounds. Show them what you got, kid. And so Ratchet began his adventure, hoping to become a galactic ranger. Oh yeah. I, I love the Ratchet game, Ratchet and Clank games because of their humor. I'm actually personally looking forward to the movie they're doing. I think it'll be pretty good. Pretty good. <clears throat> There we go. Wow. Game looks real good. <laughs> this, this is real good looking. Go around and break stuff. Insomnia games make some pretty good games. They're pretty good stuff. Ratchet bashed his enemies using his trusty Omni Rift. In order to best his foes, Ratchet used the warrior's time honored tradition of jumping. <laughs> time honored tradition. As long as I used to. As you, he faced mortal peril. Should he find himself on the verge it's of helpful. death, he'd need to find nanotech to heal. <laughs> I used that stuff after a bank robbery once. It healed like three out of five gunshots. <laughs> three out of five. <laughs> yeah, they'll work as currency, collectibles, that sort of stuff. They'll come in handy later. Oh, that one got me. This is the game based off the movie, based off a game. Look at him smashing crates. <laughs> the hubris. <laughs> Maybe he was just saving up bolts so he could buy a new weapon to protect the galaxy with. Hey, who's telling the story? With his enemies vanquished, Ratchet forged ahead. His destination? Destiny. All these cards I'm getting. Big Al here. You've just collected your first holo card. by defeating enemies or you can explore secret areas to find packs of three your goal is to complete a whole set of holo cards a whole set you don't say <laughs> right Oh, excuse me. Ah. I was gonna save this for tomorrow evening, but figured uh Dark Souls is kinda pushing my buttons a bit there, so let's take I figure would good opportunity to come back and play this. Say, aren't we? I 
Nice by another contestant. Good luck, future ranger. Hello, recruits. Cora Verilux here. Show us how quick you can be on your feet by jumping over these obstacles. Good work. Now keep moving to the next part of the course. A good ranger is always mindful of their surroundings. Pop across these moving platforms. Many of you Oops. Are asking for tips. Sage advice, if you will, from your humble galactic protector. <laughs> Whenever my life is in jeopardy, I think of one... Good job. You could be the recruit we've been looking for. Keep moving to the next part of the course. Hey there, recruit. I'm Brax Lectris, and my specialty is brute force. Let's see how well you can bash these crates. Okay. I love a good crate bashing. Man, that was pretty good. Keep moving. It's time to get our hands on some firepower. Go ahead and grab a fusion grenade glove from this Gadgetron vendor. Galaxy is a perilous place, as evidenced by the large amounts of ammunition left sitting around in crates. <laughs> if you see me at the event, please do not run up and insist on shaking hands. My mighty vice like grip has been known to shake the confidence of even the most heroic of men, <laughs> and I would hate to throw you off your game. All right. In order to spice things up, we've armed these dummies with Gadgetron flamethrowers. Our lawyers are totally cool. <laughs> what? Okay. Could be an intern. One down. Whoa. Looks like some angry toads. Another one down. Level it up. Could we be looking at Solana's next Galactic Ranger? Oh boy. Out of ammo. <laughs> right? Hey, them good lawyers. Excellent job, Cadet. Come see me after the show. Huh. That wasn't so bad. Ladies and gentlemen, the savior of Solana, Captain Quark. Hello, Veldin. Hello, Captain. He's on fire again. I know. My name is Copernicus Quark, and yes, that was an impressive wall of fire I just walked past. <laughs> I'm going to be real with you folks for a moment. When President Byronix recommended I take on a new ranger, I knew just where to go. That's right. We want you! Yeah! I know what you're thinking. Do I have what it takes? After all, you may not have prevented Dr. Nefarious from atomizing Illyro City. You may not have stopped Neptune Prague from rendering the entire population of Aridia colorblind. Twice. After all, you may not have this chiseled jaw or godlike pectoral region, but if you have heart, then you have what it takes. You don't have what it takes. But 
I have heart. Yes, but unfortunately that heart is encased in a weak, muscleless mass of inexperience. Plus there's your history to consider. Got a long line of citations here. Possession of an illegal gravity repulsor. Operation of a black market accelerator. Willful disruption of the space-time continuum. <laughs> that is a funny story. You're reckless. You're a loose cannon, and you're dangerous. That's my shtick. <laughs> Wait, God. just give me a chance. Sorry, no time. Galaxy in jeopardy. Get back out there, and remember, you can do anything, as long as you're me. Next! Meanwhile, on planet Quartu... Dr. Nefarious, the mad scientist who made all of this possible. Mad suggests cognitive impairment. I'm more of a vengeful scientist. I trust you're here to meet the troops. <laughs> State your prime objective. <laughs> Destroy Galactic Rangers. State your prime objective. Destroy Galactic Rangers. State your prime of... Hmm. Hello. Defect detected. Preparing for immediate destruction. In three, two. Oh, a defect. Go play, Victor. All right. I guess it's time for some clank. The helpless defect knew that his best chance for survival lay with the facility's ventilation system. If he could just run to the vent, he might just make it out of there alive. I know you will find the defect. You never disappoint. Feeble defect knew that if he were to survive, he would have to throw a bomb at whatever lay in his back. The young defect spotted a spring bot ahead of him and knew that with this handy device in his arsenal, he could now defeat the deadliest of forces, gravity. The hopeless defect had to throw a spring bot, but where and how? Huh. There we go. Over there. Oh boy. There you are. Oh my. Quit your running, you useless piece of scrap. Uh Get back here and let's settle this. Warbot to Warbot. Water. Suddenly, the defect spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? <laughs> You're like really good at adding drama, man. Thank you, Shin. <laughs> I pride myself on my penchant for storytelling. What seems to be the problem, Victor? You won't get away from me, Chairman. I've got him right where I want him. Oh no. You think you can run from me? Yeah. That brute again. Get back 
back here, you miserable defect! What kind of bad for this guy? Uh oh. Oh boy. I'm gonna rip you apart, sprocket by sprocket. Water. He hates water, apparently. Set coordinates for the galactic. It is a really good series. Destination set. We will never make it. But hey, what are you gonna do? Oh dear. <laughs> Another one coming up in my to do list is going to be Star Fox Zero as well. That's coming. What? Insomniac, Insomniac Games has got some really good writers on their team. No vector shell damage. Sister board appears to be intact. I must get to Alero City. They are in danger. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, who's in danger? An army is coming. I must warn them. Hang on. Slow down. You've been in a crash. What do you say we get you back to my garage? I'll run a diagnostic and have you fixed up in no time. Thank you. I appreciate the assistance. It's no problem. So, what do I call you? I suppose my proper designation is Warbot Defect B54296. Uh, maybe I'll just call you Clank. My name's Ratchet. Uh, up and down. Yeah, there you go. You're a natural. Million face to Ratchet's head. This diminutive warbot. Would it be the key to the adventure he craved? Did he leave the proto engine on in the garage? The answer to all these questions was yes. All right, hang on. I'll get us back to the garage. All right, hang on. I'll get us back to the garage. Don't go back right there, by the way. I wanted to go look around, but I shouldn't have done that. 